Hello ladies and gentlemen, this is Hollywood Matt Connolly with the Double Bicep Flex, a legal requirement every single time we appear on camera. Today we are talking about Jamie Barrett and Alan Fisher. Jamie Barrett being the 16 year old Australian sensation. Uh, he's only 16 and he is taking on a 27 time world champion legend of the sport in Alan Fisher. And fantastic to see that these opportunities are being granted to people from other sides of the world. And I believe that uh, Jamie Barrett just simply reached out to Alan and said, hey, I'm a fan of yours. I'd like to have a match with you. And Alan, being the legend that he is, says, absolutely, let's get it happening. Now, I'm not sure whether or not there was funding provided for, to get Jamie over there, but uh, either which way, whether he, he paid his own way or whether people sort of gathered some money together to get him there, he flew all the way to the other side of the world and he took on a 27-time world champion in Alan Fisher, a legend of the sport, and what a fantastic thing to see. Somebody, this is what people should be doing in the sport, ladies and gentlemen. If you want to have a name for yourself, if you want to rise through the ranks, uh, don't sit around waiting for the next tournament to come along. You can start calling people out and trying to make your own matchups. And that is exactly what Jamie Barrett did. So well done to you, sir. And thank you for doing these sorts of things because me as an arm wrestling fan, I get to see them happen. Uh, so well done to both of you, Alan Fisher and Jamie Barrett. I will talk about the match right now. If you haven't seen it, uh, there will be spoilers right now. Obviously, Alan having a wealth of experience, decades of experience, and uh, Jamie Barrett uh, being 16 years old, he's only literally been in the sport for a couple of years, but uh, fantastic to see him get up on the table. And uh, he actually did a, a phenomenal job in terms of what he was able to do in the match. The match result, I will say this again, this is a spoiler, uh, Alan Fisher ended up taking the match. It was first to three. Alan Fisher won all three matches. So it was 3-0. But there was a lot of little moments in there that Jamie really held his own. And it, the moments that he really stood out and really looked like he had a chance was outside of the straps. Uh, he looked like he was trying to press in some of the, some of the early uh, one of the early rounds, um, he was uh, able to get into a top roll position in the second round uh, before he got the, the slip on the elbow foul called. But he was no walkover. He did a great job. Once they got into the straps, you could see that the experience, the wrist of Alan Fisher was just too strong. He was able to just overpower Jamie once they got that position. But outside of straps, Jamie did a really good job. He really tried uh, to do a few different things. He did try to press. He did try top rolling. Uh, he did uh, a fantastic job for someone who's been in the sport for only such a short period of time. So well done to both of you. And Alan Fisher, you are still a an absolute legend. No one one will ever be able to surpass your 27 world champion record status i, I believe you're, you're such a, a wonderful guy and uh, we get to see you drop your knowledge uh regularly on the internet and jamie barrett keep doing what you're doing you are doing a sensational job and it is awesome to see that people are putting on these sort of matches so thank you very much and uh we will see you again soon but boom, one last double bicep just for you.